Salut à tous, j'espère que vous allez bien. Aujourd'hui, j'ai décidé de vous parler du disque Smile. Donc, euh, il y a quelques temps, je vous avais fait une vidéo pour euh, découvrir les différences entre le vrai et le faux Smile. Aujourd'hui, euh, eh j'ai la chance d'aller un peu plus loin euh, dans les investigations concernant Smile, puisque aujourd'hui est avec moi Stephen Powitzit, l'auteur de la photo de la couverture de Smile. Donc, euh, il va nous parler de ça dans quelques minutes. Alors figurez-vous que Steven en fait a fait cette photo mythique avec Michael et qu'il n'avait jamais vu en fait le disque en vrai. Donc Steven, this is the very first time for you yes, to see that I'm so vinyl. excited. So I'm thrilled. I give it to you. Yeah. So what and is I your get, feeling? And I get to keep it. So thank yes, you so no, much. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> so have you few things to tell us about that picture? The day when you shot it or? Um, well. Let's see, we shot it at Sony Music Studios, which is on West 54th in New York City. And it was the, the period of time leading up to doing it. I had to, we had to have the set built. We had to cast the child. We had to have the costume made mm -hmm. and all of that. So it was probably between the time that Michael and I met to talk about it and when we did the shoot, at least three months. So it was, it was very exciting because it was the culmination of a lot of work to put into it. Yeah. Okay. Um, and it was, it was wonderful. It was a fun day. Um, the we did, we did a, a few variations. There's a series of photos that are just tight headshots of Michael as Chaplin, yes. and that was, that was a blast doing that. So, so, so Michael had the idea of the the shoot. Yes. And you yes. were in charge to, to, to find the, the, the to, location? To, yeah, the, to, the whole, to produce the whole thing, to bring... Part of what is exciting about being a photographer isn't just, you know, snapping the picture, it's pulling all the elements together to create the photograph. And that's, that's a big part of what I, what I enjoy doing, is the, just all of, the, all of the production aspect of it. So. Okay, okay. Yes. So when when you met Michael and you start to speak about that picture, mm -hmm. he, what, so what uh, what happened? I ah. was I was in New York. The my telephone rang in my hotel and it was Michael and he said, Steve, I want to talk to you. Come to the apartment. And the apartment was in Trump Tower. It was in the tr Trump lived on the top floor. Michael lived in the next floor down. Yeah. So I walked over and and went up and. When I got there, his um, his chef was there, and but as soon as I got there, the chef left, and so it was just Michael and I alone. And um, and he said he said Steve, do you know the song Smile? I was like, I think so. And he said, Well, here I'll, I'll sing it for you. And so Michael sang Smile a cappella wow. with just me in the room, and the. You know, for me, and of course, I had heard him sing many times before and been to concerts and photograph concerts and all that. But to um, to hear the purity of his voice a cappella was something that just it, it, it gave me, you know, goosebumps, wow. my hair really on my arm standing up, well. and huh. and all of that. So he he said when he finished, I said yes, Michael, I know that song, and he's like, do you know the history of this song? And I'm like. Not really, and he, so he told me that. Um, he said, "Well, first of all, it was written by Charlie Chaplin, and I had no idea of mm -hmm. that." And he said, "Charlie Chaplin wrote the music," and I was like, "Okay." And then we, um, he, he started telling me about Chaplin, and he told me about the um, the film, um, The Kid, and he showed me in a book. Uh, 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 yes, the original yeah. picture that, and he said I want you to try to emulate this so we talked about all the elements that we needed and then he said okay that's that's what I want you to do and I you know that would began the process of I found a set builder to build the set and um, and just and then the casting took a long time I looked all over the country to find the right child he was I think from New Jersey, yes, but I, 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 I can't remember for sure. But it seems like he was from New Jersey. Nice, um, 
And it's funny because this child is now all grown up. I have no mm. idea. I'm sure he's, you know, it must be he's a big thrill for him. Old, yeah, it, it must be a big thrill for him to yeah. still be, although not very many people have mm. seen this, you know, so. And another question. Have you yeah. got some unseen pictures from this series? Yes. Of yes. yes and will you put them in the book maybe? Mm, or Perhaps. We'll yeah? see. Okay. I, I don't know. We'll see what happens. <laughs> okay, so. thank you. Je voulais aussi remercier euh, Brice qui est ici présent, euh, sans lui cette interview n'aurait pas été possible. Euh, c'est également une, une photo euh, de Steven qui est en couverture de son livre, donc c'est quand même pas mal. Et puis je veux aussi préciser que Steven est aussi l'auteur de cette fameuse photo You Are Not Alone, donc c'est vraiment euh, très très fort également. Donc merci à vous deux euh, en tout cas d'être venus, franchement c'est vraiment, vraiment super, check, double check. <rire> yeah, 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 thank you very much. Yeah. You have a little thing to tell to the fans before we... We end the video, maybe a little mm. word for them, a little... Oh. Wow, you really put me on It's the spot. It's not a navigation, <laughs> huh? you, you can do it or not. Well, uh, well what I, what I want to say to the fans is that it's important that, like what, what the legacy that Michael left me with is to, is to promote peace, to promote kindness, to promote understanding, And there's, there's so much hatred in this world. And what I try to do is I try to, I try to just practice kindness wherever I go with whomever is placed in front of me. I feel like that that's the legacy that Michael gave to me. And so I want to encourage people to do that. Very nice, very nice message. Okay. Thank you very much.